I got the 300cc teardrop high profile implant and the reason for that is I had absolutely nothing there and I was worried about those lines people get when they get around implants which I guess isn't the same for everybody. I was a 32A beforehand and now I'm a 32D or a 34C, just depends on the bra that I want to buy. The recovery process is different for everyone, uh, but for me the first week or two were the worst. I was scared to move, scared to move my arms. You have, I, was, I slept so stiff because you have to sleep on your back, um, not on your side or nothing. Um, I didn't have a shower for like a week. You get like, you just feel tight and you can kind of feel the, the implant in your chest, if that makes any sense. I got it under the muscle as well, so that I guess that hurts a bit more. Uh, a lot of sharp pains, especially in this boob. It's all good now though, uh, but it's definitely worth it. So the doctors say you need to wait uh, six weeks to fully recover. You know, you can't do, like you can't go to the gym, have sex, um, or anything strenuous like that for six weeks. But uh, I'm, I had my 10 weeks ago, and I think about four weeks in, I felt like I didn't feel any pain or anything. Not that they hurt for the whole four to six weeks, but you do get like little sharp pains in there every so often. Scars are barely visible. Um, I'd say mine are like quite, like, like you can't really see them that much anymore. They're, quite, they're very much healed, just like light pink, nothing to worry about. I think I, I was confident before, but I do definitely feel a bit more confident now. Just in terms of like clothes and stuff beforehand, I felt very limited as to what I could wear. I thought, oh, I can't wear that. Oh, like I don't have any boobs. But now 